14 threes. You don't like that number. Um, but they just had so many more possessions. And we were playing in transition um, pretty much the whole night, um, just off of turnovers alone. And um, it, it's something that I have not uh, been able to help our guys with enough um, as far as you know, playing in the crowd, playing in passing lanes, um, and then the points off uh, turnovers. Um, you know, 36 points off of turnovers is, is hard to, you got to do something extraordinary um, to overcome that. And we just didn't do a good job tonight. Mar DeRozan, yeah, 18 was 39, came in the third quarter. But when he's on it like he is tonight, how tough is it to stay in front of him? Man, it's, it's, it's tough. I mean, he's, you know, now he's added the three ball to his game. And so you're closing out to a guy that can put it down and get to his spot and shoot the mid range. And so I thought our guys were kind of in between on their closeouts. I thought we shifted off of him uh, too far um, tonight. And he's not a guy that, you know, they can't shoot that shot anymore. He's always been able to shoot, but it's it's been from the mid range off the dribble, um, playing in isolations. And now he's added uh, the three ball to his game and makes him a really tough cover. The turnovers have been kind of one of the, the consistent, you mentioned a consistent issue from the start to the finish. With that, do you think that's something that may be part of a guy's DNA, or is that something you think can be fixed from a player? Well, I, I know it can be fixed. I've seen it before. Um, I do believe there's just so much um, player in, player out that there's not a lot of continuity out there. And so guys are maybe not spaced properly. Sometimes we're playing in a crowd. Um, but tonight was one of those nights where the ball stuck more than it typically should or does. But I, I firmly believe you can um, overcome turnovers just by, one, having continuity, and two, just understanding where they happen. You know, we, we had 12 from uh, J.I. Sass and JD, those are three guys that we need to have the ball. Um, and so I don't want to take away their aggressiveness, but there were times where I thought our smaller guards were playing downhill in the crowd, and, and they're pretty big, and they put their hands on you. I thought there was some, some physicality tonight that we didn't handle well, but that's how uh, those guys play Caruso and, and JC. Those guys are going to put their hands on